at 6. We're going to paraphrase Mark Twain here. If you can make a living doing something you love, you will never have to work a day in your life. That's true for one young man in Kenmore who is passionate about pizza. Our man Mike Randall has the story. The name outside says Jay's, but inside it's Joe who's clearly in charge. It's the Neapolitan like slap is what they call it. That's how Joe it Powers may actually be a pizza phenom, if there is such a thing. Some places in Naples only do uh, the margarita and the marinara. You could get, go there and they only do two pizzas. He started working at Jay's Artisan Pizza about four years ago, during college. I just worked at the counter. I took people's orders and, you know, brought them their pizza. Joe decided he liked making pizzas more than going to school. And I like absolutely hated it. And I'm like, I want to get out of doing school. Jay, the owner, encouraged Joe to go off to pizza school. So Joe headed off to Italy. It's 14 days. There's a campus right in Naples, Italy. And it's pretty much like a, a boot camp for 14 days. Like you go there, you learn about all different types of ingredients, the tradition. The pizzas that Joe whips up are a bit different than the traditional buffalo pizza. OK, maybe they're really different. The big thing is like fermentation of the dough. So it goes for 24 hours at room temperature. Other differences? Well, these pizzas are 12 inches round and in the oven for only 90 seconds. Joe says you can take your pizzas to go if you like, but it's really best to eat them right out of the oven. Mm. Joe's right. His story doesn't end here. The former owner recently turned the restaurant over to Joe. And Joe's pizza skill was just recognized in an exclusive Italian food blog as being in the top 50 pizzas in the U.S. I like texted my sister. I'm like, wait, are we actually going to be like on this list? Like, I couldn't believe it. Now, since we're talking numbers, Joe's pizza landed 28th on the list. And Joe Powers, pizza maker extraordinaire, is only 23 years old. No matter what age you are, you, I mean, if you, if you, dream it, you could accomplish anything. And if you really want to work for it, you know, you could do anything. It sounds like Joe Power's story is just beginning. In Kenmore, Mike Randall, 7 Eyewitness News.